And next is Peter Meyer. Peter, uh, go ahead. Hi, colleagues. I'm going to talk about the future of the North American affiliates. And by affiliates, I mean the or user groups and such like organizations that are associated with the Wikimedia Foundation. The term chapter is used for the ones that are formally nonprofit organizations. And I am the new president of the Washington, D.C. chapter. And that meant this year I had to sign many official documents, tax forms, bank forms, business licenses, and grant submissions for the chapter. And these are legally binding documents, which can be scary. It's not quite what volunteers should be doing. We came here to build a public software encyclopedia. So I'm going to talk about how chapters might work together. But we must be humble that a chapter is not the most important thing. The most important thing are the online sites, which are called projects in this context. The North American affiliates are mostly small, run by volunteers. In a larger organization, there are things we could do that we can't now do, make multi-year commitments, because we depend on year-to-year -year funding. We could have stronger administrative and finance capabilities. We would have backup if we had a problem. We could coordinate the calendars of our many different lists of events, make them shared amongst ourselves. And we could cover more of the US. We actually don't have chapters covering all, covering all the US, but there are museums that we should partner with everywhere. OpenStreetMap, it's been nice to work with them uh, on this conference and to see how they do things. They have a better arrangement with one large US organization. It has staff, doesn't need very much, and very large volunteer participation too. Now the Wikimedia Foundation wants us to find some way to work together the term they use is hubs, and they are offering grant pilot efforts to work together, uh, creating a, a pilot hub project. So Sunday afternoon, we have a time scheduled to discuss proposing a pilot project among whichever North American affiliates are interested, a pilot hub, or if you might think of it as a federation among these groups. But there are things to worry about. There are things to avoid. There's a history to why the US affiliates are small and don't cover all the territory. So there are things to be careful about. There were people who didn't want a very powerful US affiliate that would somehow dominate other Wikimedia organizations. We should avoid requiring English if it's a multinational uh, collaboration. We want to say it is multilingual from the beginning and we don't force English on everyone, and that it's multinational if it turns out to be. And as in the past, volunteers on the projects don't have to join any chapter, any organization. They don't have to pay any fee. They can do 95% of everything online without being a member of anything. But if we're gonna have chapters, they should be effective. And likewise, the user groups we now have don't have to join the pilot effort. And if they join, they have every right to leave. We want to find something that works for a bunch of them together. But there are good examples. Um, Central and Eastern Europeans proposed the hub, and they have a much more complicated problem than we do. They have many countries that are small with different languages. They even have a war in their territory. And they made a good proposal. We can, have, all our problems are simple compared to theirs. If we propose to formally work together, we would get a grant to do it, and then we would need to take on some tasks and make them work. So one thing would be to run this North America conference a little more the way OSM does their conferences. They have multiple conferences a year, and they have professionals. We are all volunteers, and so th some things get thrown together. Another thing would be to combine some of that administrative work I mentioned. Maybe most important, we want to propose something visionary, something really appealing. And there are so many such good projects that I don't actually want to get into it in a lightning talk. We can talk about that on Sunday. But we want to offer something that is useful to the North Americans working on Wikimedia and also useful to people around the world working on Wikimedia. And there are several audiences uh, to be satisfied by the proposal. Since we're asking a global committee, of the foundation 
to consider our hub proposal. We should be trying to make something that is useful around the world. Some people think that is too high an ambition, but actually, this is what we joined to do. Volunteers love to work on projects like that. So I don't think it's the hardest part, but we need to pick something that is very feasible. So the next step would be meet at three o'clock Eastern time on Sunday if this uh, affiliate uh, rearrangement suits you or email me or any of the other chapter officers of any chapter or user group. We should brainstorm. We should compare to OpenStreetMap and to other organizations that have user groups around the world, pick a feasible set of things that we can propose to do next year, find consensus that we can do it, and then file a grant proposal. That's really quite doable. They're looking to say yes. And um, I've spoken a little bit naively and directly about it. There are a lot of people on this call who know much more than I do. So we do need a lot of input. But there's a good chance for making this work. And we should try, because together we could be strong. Together we can be smart. Thank you.